Okay, today we are going to do our practice test for our test tomorrow. You need to make sure that you go home tonight and study. And also, you need to make sure that you are using your strategies. For instance, I have count back as a strategy, so you have to figure out which one of these is a count back math problem. Also, if it says to use certain um, items like counters, then you need to draw counters, or if it asks you to do cubes, then you need to do cubes, okay? The directions down here say to count back one, two, or three, so we read it from left to right, like we always do. So 7 minus 3 equals what? And our difference goes here. Okay, that's the only thing that's different. Also, remember our families. So no matter which number you choose, it has to be true in both of these. Okay, our our number is going to be different. I see a lot of you shaking your heads. They should not be different. They should be the same and it should be true. Okay? Make sure that you read your directions because this says which addition fact helps us solve this. So this is our subtraction fact, but we want to find an addition fact that will help us with this. It's our family or our related fact that we've been talking about. And then remember these? Here's the first step. Here's the second step. Okay? So you need to make sure that one of these shows what is going on in both pictures. Okay? Same with number 14. And then you have to choose which one would best fit this story. Same with number 16. So everyone go ahead and get out both of your, or well, I guess all of your colorful pages. Go ahead and get out all of your colorful pages, bless you. But I want you to flip to the very back to where you see the birds, the pages with the birds. We're going to start on this one. Go ahead and put your folders up. It is going to be on our desk. So you need to make sure, no, 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 put your folders like this, boys. Not away, put them up. Thank you. Okay, there's a lot of directions here, so we're going to have to read them, do our directions, and then go back and check to make sure we've completed all of our directions. Let's read up here where it says Chantel. Please read with me. Chantel solves a subtraction problem. Ooh, what sign are we going to use? A plus or a minus sign? Minus sign. She uses the following clues. The difference is four. So what does it have to equal? Four. Ooh, that's important. You can count back one, two, or three. It's completely up to you how you count back. But it has to equal what? Oh. Ah, thank you. Okay. Use addition to help you subtract. So not only do I need a subtraction sentence, but I need it. I need it. Subtraction. Addition. I need the addition one that looks exactly like it. And if it looks a lot like it, what is it called? A fact family. So, whenever I complete the subtraction,
subtraction sentence, I still need its family member, but it has to be addition. So I'm going to move this down here. This minus this equals what? Four. Four. So it's already got some of your um, answer for you. Okay. But what number is going to go right here? Very good. One, two, or three. Can all of those numbers fit there? No, you get to choose. So then this, whenever I am subtracting, this number has to be the biggest, biggest number. So is this going to be bigger than four? No. Yes. Yes, it has to be because it has to be the Big, biggest, biggest number. number if, it, if it's not bigger than four, it then it work. can't work. Oh, okay. <laughs> also, you need to be careful because if I put five, is that bigger than four? Yes. yes. Yeah. But if I put three down there, Five minus three, is that true that it no. equals four? No. So it also has to be true. Okay. But then if I do that, make sure that my addition sentence, four plus blank equals, has to be your biggest number. Remember, it has to be my exact same numbers. Does everyone remember their fact families? Yeah. Yeah. Um, Hey, I hope so. So let's do a fact family real quick. I'm not going to use any of the same numbers. So should you copy me? Why not? Because, because that's, that's, not, not, that's not cheating. That's cheating. cheating. That's correct. But am I going to use the same numbers that you're supposed to use over here? Yes. No, I'm not. I'm going to use different numbers. Okay, let's do 10 minus 3 equals... Seven. Seven. So if I'm going to switch it around to make an addition sentence, I'm going to put this. Seven. Seven. Plus. plus where'd you get three? From the subtraction oh. Do I have to have that number? Yes. yes. Yeah. Equals. Ten. Where did you get ten? It's From the subtraction sentence. Oh. See, I have my 7, I have my 3, and I have my 10. Is this a family member to this yes. one? Yes. yes, it is. Do these have to be family members? Yes. Yes, they do. Does anyone have any questions?